guys. We're in our room in San Francisco, uh, kind of high up over the San Francisco skyline. We've been in San Francisco for five days, uh, done quite a few things. We can actually see the San Francisco Bridge from the room here, which is pretty cool. It's a little foggy right now, so it's kind of hard to see. Like I said, we've been here for five days, so we've done quite a few things already. Like we went to Fisherman's Wharf, which was pretty cool. Ate down there, had some really good seafood, walked around, saw all different kinds of things. I got pooped on by a seagull, which is pretty nice. Um, what else have we done since we've been here? We also went to Chinatown. I think someone told us it's like seven blocks long, three blocks wide, and there's 23,000 people that live in that small little area. So uh, that's pretty interesting. It's, it's always cool to see, see stuff like that. Uh, while we were down in Fisherman's Wharf, there's Pier 39, which I don't think we even really knew was down there, weren't really expecting it. It's kind of like, it's a, definitely a touristy place, but there's a lot of cool shops down there. We found a beer spot that we've actually been to a couple times. Uh, on the way back that night, we rode the trolley. So when you come to San Francisco, you obviously have to ride the trolley. There's a big line to get on most of them. I don't think people in San Francisco take the trolley to get from work. Like, I feel like living outside of here, you might think that, but I think most people going to work and stuff are either taking Ubers or public transportation like the bus or the train. They have a train that heads in and out of town. Yesterday, we went to see the Golden Gate Bridge. Uh, we actually took a ride over the bridge and then up over there there's like a big big hill which is like a protected park uh, that you can hike up and down and there's the uh, San Francisco Bay Battery and all that um, I don't know what did you think of the park uh, this is Lindsay hi my wife I was terrified at first I was not sure I was gonna be able to go across the bridge or hike up the hill but it was probably the most breathtaking view I've ever seen. I'm glad that we went up as high as we did. Uh, we saw some really cool things. It was, it was, just, it was beautiful. You could see the ocean. You could see sea lions. You could see the birds. It was just, it, it was really awesome. I can't believe we were as high as we were. Yeah, we could have went higher. I know. I, I that was tough. There's a cool area. There's like all the batteries from when they used to protect the bay, I guess. There's like spots where they would have cannons. None of the cannons are there. I didn't realize there was any of that history I didn't there. either. It doesn't really seem like they focus on, focus on it. Like there's not much rote about any of that stuff. But there's, there's spots on both sides of the bay where they obviously had defenses set up. Well, right underneath the bridge, when we came back, when we walked across the bridge to come back to San Francisco, you could see it right at the base of the bridge mm -hmm. um, and where all the cannons had been, but there's not a lot of information about it. Yeah, so we actually took an Uber over the bridge, got out and hiked up the hill uh, to the lookout points and all that. It's a lot of spots where you see San Francisco bridge pictures taken from, obviously, because it's like public places and you can get up there and it's like really beautiful up there. but. And then we hiked back down the hill and then all the way across the bridge. The bridge is 1.7 miles, if everyone wants to know that. Uh, when we got back, Lindsay actually thought we might hike back to our hotel. And I'll show you guys how far we are. Too far. It was, I think it was, what, between four and five miles? Probably. Back from the bridge. Yeah, and we'd already hiked like three or four, probably, Yeah. up at that point. And, you know, when you're on vacation, you don't just want to. Oh, but I would definitely recommend walking across that bridge because you can stop. They have these little lookouts that you can see all the boats. Um, you can see, we saw some dolphins. We saw some sea lions. Um, I don't know what else we saw, but it was, I mean, just beautiful. I loved it. So today we are headed to Alcatraz, which is obviously out in the bay there. Uh, the stripes. Yeah. We tried to watch The Rock last night in the room, but we couldn't find it on, Netflix does not have The Rock, apparently. But we're gonna go to Alcatraz. So let's go. All right, we're here. We made it to the island.
video tour here. <laughs> it's pretty nice out here. It wouldn't be so bad, huh? Got a baseball stadium. We toured Alcatraz, it was very cool. Saw all the attempted escaped places, that was kind of neat. Anything from the movies. We're still trying to find the building that has the shower scene and the shootout from the movie The Rock. That's why I'm making Lindsay continue to walk. She's not Just very happy about it. of the day. Yep, we're gonna miss it. I missed the boat. Missing the boat, but it's worth it. This right here, we learned on the tour, was the warden's house. I mean, the warden got to live here with this view. Think about that. And the house doesn't look too small. Yeah, nice fireplace. I'm not sure what this was. Not really sure. See, some of this was, had Civil War Fort protection uh, stuff built on here. Which is why there was cannons. back to Charlotte. We had a fun time. Uh, Alcatraz was awesome. The rest of our trip was awesome. Yay! Did you have fun? We had a blast. Good time on the West Coast. Uh, Alright. Peace out.